Hi guys, in today's video, I will be doing this DIY clock. I saw this clock in someone else's home and I absolutely fell in love with it. So I hope you guys sit back and enjoy this video. So I'm just gonna unbox it and see exactly what I am working with, get all my pieces together and sort things out so I can begin this mini project. So this is the base of the clock and the hands for the clock. Um, we don't need this right now so I'm going to set this in a box and I'm going to set this aside and I am going to begin. So what I have here are the numbers for the clock and the numbers are on this foam which you see me pull off the number eight and they on this like kind of plastic like but it's kind of hard so what you do is you pop it out of the phone you pop it out of the plastic piece you pull the white part off the plastic piece but you leave the white part on the back of the phone because that is the part that sticks to the wall or wherever you may put this clock at so this can be the tedious part of this DIY project because you want to make sure you align that thick plastic um, evenly with the phone. Like you don't want you know too much foam or less plastic because it's not going to look right when you get ready to go hang it. So all I'm going to do is go through all 12 numbers and the letters that I have here and I'm going to attach them to the phone so continue watching to the end of the video because you do not want to miss the end results
I am finally done putting all the pieces to the foam and I am just sorting them out making sure I have all of them and they are correct so when it came to the hanging part I had to call my brother because this part was the most confusing part for me so he came over to um, hang my clock for me thank you uh, anyways um I am putting this in my living room and as you can see um, it comes with the little measuring tool so that you know exactly how far apart they are so they can be like exactly right and he did an awesome job doing that are now adding the hands to the clock and the batteries which the batteries just go to the back of the base it's one double a battery you just pop in there and you're good to go now that my clock is up I have to take these it's a really thin piece of plastic over the numbers and it's just to secure the numbers to give it a shiny look so now I just have to go through all of the numbers make sure I remove all of the plastic and we're done the hard part is over I want to give a shout out to my friend Linda for getting me this clock because she knew when I saw it I absolutely fell in love with it and she made it happen for me. So she's the best. Thank you. And she knew exactly what my living room needed because it just made my living room look just that much better. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed my DIY clock. Until the next time, into the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.